Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are doing great today. Well, I'm here because I finally finished this flip book. The paper that I used, Pebbles, from, the brand is Pebbles, and this is called Garden Party. And that's the name of the paper pad. It's really beautiful. These are all the designs that it has on the paper pad. Absolutely beautiful to me. It's, and um, I also use this ephemera pack that I from Dear Lizzie and um, this is called it doesn't have a name but it's from Dear Lizzie so I used a couple of um, pieces from here and I also used this sticker sheet it's a uh, accents and phrases stickers from Dear Lizzie as well it looks like this and um, I used this die this is from Spellbinders. I love this bird die. It's been a while I haven't used it. So I use that. Um, I use my punches. I use this punch. This fern punch. I also use, to me, it looks like, I don't know the name of this, but it looks like a lattice punch. So I got that. I use that one. I use this one. There. I use that one. And um, let's see. And I used my um this. It's one and three eighths um scalloped punch, round scallop punch. So I used that as well. So let me go ahead and share with you what I made. Very simple, but I loved how it came out. I love it. So I saw there's too much floral here, so I went ahead and I added a doily in the background, a white doily. This is, these two are stickers, uh, phrases from here. And um, it's just got a camera, and then I use enamel dots that I had in my stash, also from Michael's Dollar Fifty bin. And then here it says, make every moment count. Um, and then here are the paper flowers from Michael's Dollar Fifty bin, and these two. And then I just added enamel dots there, there, and here. Here is my fern leaf punch that I I put there, and it's being held by this um, clip. So, and then I just um, put some charms together. This is a heart sequence that I've had in my stash. These two charms, the little daisy, white daisy, and the leaf. is So it's being held together um, with this clip. And what I did, because the paper is not double-sided, I cut um, six by six. This is six by six, and I backed them up. I backed one against the other, um, glued them back to back. Then I used washi that I've had for my stash. Uh, chose a color that best matched with the paper. So I just added it on here as the binding. I added on here for the for the edge. And then when you open it up, it looks like this. I, so I shared with you this, and this is new. I just added this. And it's a banner that says you're a whole lot of lovely. And then two enamel dots. And it also comes from this um, ephemera pack from Dear Lizzie. And then um, here is stickers that I used from Hobby Lobby and um, it's uh, me and my big ideas sticker sheets uh, or sticker book um, I don't have it here on my table and uh, so I use the little circle stickers and I put here die cuts and here I have some die cuts in this little pocket and then here's the doily again, the black doily from Michaels. This also is from the ephemera pack, and I added two uh, enamel dots in different colors. And I just love how that came out. Made a banner right here, like a little belly band. Then here I had not finished, and I finally finished it. And what I did is I made a little booklet, and it says notes using the same stickers for me and my big ideas. And then here are the flowers again. The little petals from um, the dollar fifty bin. I added it there. There's my fern leaf. I cut this out from the paper pad as well using this is a Spellbinders label die. I don't know what number it is because I bought it in a D stash, so I have no idea. And this, um, there's a few sheets in here, and um, if she wants to take it out, she could take it out or, or you know, write whatever notes that she wants to write in there. 
you know, it's up to her, whoever I give this to, because I have no idea how I'm going to give it to. And, um, but it's just an idea. And then here, I really like this, but it's very busy. I wanted to put this bow here, but this sheet is very busy. So I added a uh, half of a white doily. Um, and then I'm able to add this bow that also came from the Dear Lizzie ephemera pack. I added an enamel dot there. And then this sticker is also a sticker phrase that comes from the sticker pad from Dear Lizzie, like this. And here says, fill your heart with what matters. Oh, I'm sorry. Fill your heart with what's important. That's what it says. And um, it's really nice. I, I like that's what it says. And um, then here I put some more enamel dots right there. And then when you open it up, it's like this. So what I did here is I used my lattice punch, the Martha Stewart. And then I punched out all these petals using this punch from the paper pad and I did two of them and I like layered one on top of the other added an enamel dot here is the fern right there and then um, here's a sticker also from the sticker phrase book and it says busy being happy and um, you know I like to say oh I've been busy as a bee or you've been busy as a bee and then it says busy being happy I thought that was perfect with this um, with this image right here on this paper pad with all the little bees and stuff. So I did kind of like a scenery. This um, replicates like the sun. This is a white um, doily, paper doily. And since I couldn't find yellow, so what I did is I inked it up with light yellow ink. And um, so I was able to make that. And then here, uh, which is a honeycomb print, uh, from the paper pad, I die cut this bird as if it's on a, um, on a wire, you know, in the yard or something. So all these little birds are on the wire and there's the sun, you know, they're getting some sun and stuff. So that's what was my idea when I put this together. And then here is some uh, die cuts and uh, project life cards and it, um, it's being held together with a lip paper clip and then here uh, I did a little book and I added um, with gold stickers dots and I made a little banner with a little with partial scallop punch and a butterfly right there and I was actually inspired there's this girl that I'm, I'm watching little little hot tamale I believe is her channel um, she does cute little embellishments paper embellishments and that's where I got this idea from so um, then the book, here's a little book, and here are some, I'm sure, some enamel, enamel dots that I've had in my stash in three colors. So it's like a pink peach, uh, a white one, and a baby blue one. And I made a book like, you know, like so. Um, used my tiny attacher to staple it together, and then I just added washi for the binding. Very simple. Then here, um, it says hey doll and it's like uh, like hello and then my letter um, right now the card is empty a Heidi swap um, no card set so I used the um, vellum envelope that was in the set and um, then the card that goes with it and uh, you know whoever whoever I decide to give this to if they have any questions for me I could just write my little letter there and answer what I can answer and yeah and then this is washi that I have for my stash little birds um, peach washi also from my stash um, I added a heart washi also right there and a floral print washi and then I did another little um, embellishment up here also inspired by little hot tamale and um, I put a little Mambi sticker that says smile there and then, yeah, you saw this already. And um, and then here's the back. And I have my information there. And it is being held with this clip. So I really think I really love it. I love how it came out. Um, it's not too thick, you know. I When I make my mini albums, I make them really thick, which has been a while. I haven't done one. But um, I really love how this turned out. And alright everyone, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful 
evening rest of the evening and until next time bye